A former Jacksonville leader who had a big impact on the city was honored today. A public celebration of life for former Mayor Jake Gobbel was held at the Prime Osborne Convention Center. Gobbel served in the city's top spot from 1979 until 1987. And he died last month at the age of 86. And First Coast News reporter Ken Amaro was there. And Ken, we know it must have been an emotional service. Jake Godbold developed his compassion for people and his passion for this city right here in this Brentwood community. In fact, when he started a business, he started it here. It is still here. Hours before the celebration of his life and legacy, friends and supporters gathered to pay their respects to the man known to everyone as Jake. Martha Barrett worked with Godbold eight and a half years. She was his friend. It's a very sad day, but yet it's a very happy day. I know the mayor is in heaven. Former Mayor Alvin Brown won his confidence. The city has lost a giant, someone who is the voice for the voiceless. They wanted it to be uplifting, and a New Orleans-style brass band led the procession, setting the tone for the celebration of his life. An estimated 1,500, including Mayor Lenny Curry, crowded the convention hall to say goodbye. Good Former Mayor John Payton, who was an intern, remembered the spirit of the man. Jake worked hard to bring everybody to the table. Betty Holzendorf, she was an aide and remembered his compassion. I'm going to miss him because he was my friend. I'm going to miss him because I cared about him. I'm going to miss him because he cared about me. Godbold served two terms as mayor. Among his accomplishments are an NFL team, the Riverwalk, the Jazz Festival, the Convention Center, JTB, Mayo Clinic, to name a few. His tenure is being called the Billion Dollar Decade. His last public campaign was to stop the sale of the JA. He won. I see trees of green. Maurice Godbold, the mayor who encouraged a city to believe in itself. One person said losing Jake is losing a friend and a public servant. Canamero, First Ghost News, on your side.